This is our channel, and we're trying some shit. This is our very first video. Uh, so maybe this is the first House of Fun YouTube channel. There's probably already 14 House of Fun channels. Oh, yeah. Well, no, come up with something new. There's the House of Fun Australian guys that have a TV show. Yeah, so we can't be that, even though we live in a place called the House of Fun. But we also, uh, we can't be Steve and Joe or Joe and Steve because everybody thinks that's Blue's Clues. Uh, but we will, I, there will be some learning. There will be. But I there also looked some up learning. some things, and I do think we could be safe if we called this the Gruff and Loud Show. I, like I don't that. think there's any. I like any, the Loud and Gruff Show. Oh, I like all right. You can call it Loud and Gruff, and I can call it Gruff and Loud. I, I prefer. I prefer. Fuck it. That's fine. If you call it Loud and Gruff, people might think it's a different thing than it actually is. Exactly. That's why. And I you, like have loud you watched and gruff. Loud and Gruff? Oh man, what is it? A rock and roll heavy metal show? Oh, what do they talk about? Oh, dude, they talk about anything. What are they? They're Loud and Gruff. Loud and Gruff. It does sound like a rock and roll show. And today we are going to be talking about. Rock, rock and, and roll. roll, but maybe the not the rock, rock and roll, roll you're thinking of. What? We might not be talking about the rock and roll you're thinking of when we say loud. And I don't know. He was. It was the first rock and roll that I knew only as rock and roll and that I loved as yes, you know, a goal. Rock and roll for guys our age in our generation. There's anybody pretty much. Maybe you could say Gen Xers. Can I say a soundtrack? Can I can I go off topic for a second? You can do anything you want to do because you're has gruff. Been a, I learned a wonderful fact today that uh, do you know how they always do the top 100 rock and roll songs? Time. Top 100. We grew up with uh, it sure. on, on our local. When rock you say and they, station. just like they, meaning they our local stations, classic rock and MTV, rock and roll stations. maybe yeah, Probably other not places. On TV. I'm thinking more classic VH1. rock. I'm yeah. thinking. Maybe VH1, probably VH1. But yeah. uh, uh, for Toledo listeners or viewers, 94.5, yeah. you know, a 94.5 channel. XKR, baby. Yeah, for, for, the, for those. W-I-O-T. The, for the, w, that's W1047. 1047 W-I-O-T. Yeah. Or I-O-T. The, WRIF 101.1 from back in the day from those in Detroit. WMMS 100.7. What I'm saying oh, is that Joan Jett... You just wanted us to just name a bunch of stations? No, I, I'm, just, we I'm just buying WFPD. time. Oh. I'm just buying time. Because we, we, we have a morning show vibe. Hey, we do have a morning show vibe. We have a drive time vibe. We have hey, a radio show vibe. good morning. You're waking up with Gruff and Loud. We're loud and loud. Gruff. We're loud and we're Gruff. We're loud. And I'm Gruff. <laughs> we're, we're Gruff. I'm sorry. We're Gruff. So I'll I'm say, so we're sorry. loud. And, and we're gruff. It's the loud and gruff show. All right, we'll work on that. We know you like it loud. We know you like it gruff. And we're here to give it to you loud and gruff. And we're not too proud, and we're not going to be too rough. But don't worry, we'll all be tough enough to get through. That's true. And he has a Prince Albert. I do. <laughs> I like and now pro- you know too I, much about us. I like to refer to it as a knowing regret. <laughs> People are gonna love this channel, man. Well, this is I mean, gonna be everybody's favorite channel. I, I, Generation I, X. I'd like to think we can talk to bo- from boomers to zoomers because that yeah, rhymes. Boomers will, boomers will like this because we're just out of touch enough with reality, so it doesn't embarrass them as as much. Or with technology and things, zoomers will like us as a kitsch thing. Like we have no pride, like it. and we have very little egos. Yeah. Zoomers will like us because it's like, look how lame our dads are, but lame is cool now, right well, now. I mean, so when we were kid, when we were their age, bad was cool. So, yeah. So just saying then that makes us that much lamer. But what I was gonna say, I don't know who cares what millennials will say. They'll just I, think we have dad bods. I, I mean, I really don't care what anyone says, which I, it might be a problem. No, you don't give a fuck. Fair. Okay, go ahead. Your sidetrack. What's your sidetrack? Joan Jett. After, let's put aside these sidetracks to get to your sidetrack. Joan Jett's I Love Rock and Roll, number one song in the top 100 rock and roll songs of all time. It's for the number one year. song? For this year. Of Which year? This year. 
like they 20, just, 21? like every year they do a top 100 classic rock or rock and roll songs and yeah. generally t- the number one is either like bohemian rhapsody stairway to heaven or layla it's one of those yeah. three this year joan jett and the black hearts according, according to rock who? and roll according to random survey poll just one that you read today? Yeah, one that made me happy. And I was like, I don't want to do any more research. It made me happy, and it doesn't matter. It's cotton candy of news. You can just say that that is now, as of today, that's the number to one some rock and roll random song. poll that I read <laughs> on uprocks.com, Joan Jett. And this might have been a dream you had. I. This world might be a dream I have. Well, that's what I like about this. You can just proclaim this is a channel where you can proclaim whatever you want as fact right here, and you don't even have to name the source. Well, I mean, no, we're going to name the source. It was uprocks.com. Yeah, well, that's the source of the poll. Of the article but if you're that saying, I read on. But you're saying a thing that's not, it's an opinion. What's the best rock and roll exactly. thing all time? It's subjective. But you're stating that it's fact, and you can do that. Well, that's on the Loud I mean, Gruff show. There, there's, there, there's. I mean, a problem in this world of no one being willing to. Hey, man, I'm saying these Harris Teeter Fig Bar cookies are the greatest Fig Bar cookies made by Harris Teeter of all time. Yeah, I mean, in your in your subjective opinion, that is true. No, you don't have to add all that. Well, well but I'm we saying can if we, we want to. We're not going to go with the liberal agenda and name all our sources. Oh, I thought the only agenda we were going to have was yours, for fuck's sake. We're not going to. We're going to. We're not. We're going to. We're going to drink liberal tears on this. I, I th- I'm drinking a big glass just, of liberal tears. Can we just drink tears? Does it have to be liberal? Could I drink? No, one? man. We gotta. We gotta own the libs, bro. Why do you think I got a Prius? I got a Prius to own the libs. I put a bunch of gay pride flags on it because I'm going to own the libs, baby. Isn't that how it works? Is I don't know how it works. Do you now have kids? Is that how you own the libs? I don't know how you own shit. I okay. read.